Uh, it's more about meeting people, getting to understand a little bit more about what's going on. I'm already familiar with the African market, less so on the technology side, but I'm also interested in that. A certain amount of this is actually giving back and supporting what's going on as well. A lot of my investors are not terribly interested in supporting the African markets, they're interested purely in making money. And if we're going to make money out of it, well, let's try and give something back along the way. My approach in African tech is the same as African buyout and is the same as anything else. I'm there to make money. As I said, my clients are pension funds. They're not altruistic. They have a legal obligation to make money. So when I'm looking at African tech, I'm looking at something that's delivering a solution to people who've got money to spend. Yeah, one of the things that people will often tell you is that if you're investing in Africa, it's going to be higher risk, therefore you should be getting a higher return. I'm comfortable with that and I get that and there's an element of that. However, the reality is Africa is giving me diversification. So if I'm getting the same level of return as I'm getting in the UK or the US, but I'm getting additional risk diversification as well, then I'm getting a big benefit from that. So it doesn't have to be a higher risk. When I'm looking at risk, when I'm considering return, I'm looking at where my money or my client's money will be spent otherwise, and that's in public markets. So I want to get a return that's higher than on public markets, probably of the order of 5% higher. Most interesting markets are bluntly the biggest. Where you've got numbers, you can actually make money. If you can sell something to every Nigerian for one Naira every day, you're going to be fabulously wealthy. And that's the whole premise of the cell phone networks. They are pretty much doing that. They're selling small amounts of data, small amounts of coverage to people every day. And they're extending that to hundreds of millions. That's a great way to make money.